Barbara Hickey is a colon cancer survivor. Her life changed dramatically at age 43 when she was first diagnosed. Lots, lots to do and then all things crashed down on us when I was diagnosed. Hickey fought her cancer thinking she had made it, but five years later she was diagnosed a second time. It got harder for me to sit and I figured there's something down there in the backside that is not right. After her second surgery, a colostomy removing her rectum, Hickey knew she had to make some big changes. I had to go on disability. At my job, I sat at a computer probably for three quarters of the time, and I just, I couldn't do it. It was just too painful. Monica Joshi started the Push for Your Tush Walk in Durham Region to support more survivors like Hickey. Colorectal cancer is the second leading cause of cancer death in Canada, with nearly 27,000 Canadians diagnosed in 2017. Uh, my aunt was diagnosed in April of 2007 from, for colon cancer and I wanted to do something for her so I decided to organize a walk in June of 2008 and she passed away actually February 5th, 2008 so she never got to uh, come to one of my walks. Joshi says one of the hurdles with this cancer is that people have a hard time talking about it. But opening up is exactly what's needed. Colon cancer has an over 90% cure rate if caught in stage 1. And that's what we're trying to do is bring it, bring it out with all these funny things about talking with, your, you know, talk to your butt and talk about your colon and we want to make it easy to talk about. Successful events like Push for Your Tush are needed to raise more funds and awareness to support great causes like Colorectal Cancer Canada. I was 43. I didn't think I was going to see 44. And here I am, 69 years old. So. Push has grown to over 2,000 participants in 11 cities across Canada. It supports people like Hickey and generates greater public awareness with the hope of saving more lives. I'm Jennifer Steele for Say News, Toronto.